Hey Dynamic 36 Fibers, it's Benitez here and in this quick tip today I'm going to be showing you how you can display a lookup field as a drop down in Dynamics portals. The scenario is your users are viewing a form in Dynamics portals and there is a lookup field that you would like to display as a drop down field. The good news is this is supported in Dynamics portals and you don't need any code at all. So without further ado, let's jump straight into it. I'm in my Dynamics 365 instance, and as you guessed it, we are using a Webform metadata record. In case you haven't seen any of my previous vlogs, go check it out, because I've now showcased how you can use Webform metadata to update the, um, the fields that are showing in Dynamics portals, so things like showing a hyperlink and helper text, as well as increasing the field label for a field in Dynamics portals. So what I'm going to show you is making a lookup field appear as a drop-down field in Dynamics portals. So typically a lookup field will look like this in Dynamics portals and in the scenario where let's say you only have five records it's a bit excessive to show this lookup records view when there's only five um, values to choose from or let's say you know two to choose from. So the way to change a lookup to a drop down field is using a web form metadata and you select the type of attribute and you select the field that represents the lookup. And down here there is a section called control style and the field that you want to update is style. And when you scroll down there is an option here called render lookup as drop down. So this is the one I'm going to select and this is the control style that will update that lookup to a drop down field in Dynamics portals. Okay, let's refresh the page. Ta! -da! As you can see, the lookup is now displaying as a drop down field and with simple configuration steps and using the web form metadata and using the style field in the web form metadata record in Dynamics 365, you can simply change a lookup to a drop down field. And that's my quick tip today. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Like below if you did. If you want my full blog post, that's posted below as a URL in this YouTube description. I'll see you next time and as always, Follow me on Twitter and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll see you next time. Bye!